Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. My name's Trey, and today we're going to show you how to use KickBot to create a Stream Deck command for your clips. Super simple setup, super easy to use. KickBot.app is where we're going to be. That link will be in the description for your convenience. And once you're there, you'll have to log in with your Discord. I've already done it, so we're going to go straight to Dashboard. Now, I want to show you a few things about the KickBot. There is a premium version down here in the bottom left. It will give you uh, kit command limits on... There's 120 seconds for the free user. It should be enough, in my opinion. But if you want to support this development, uh, you can pick up the, free, or the premium version. It's got a lot of cool features, like uh, TTS Voice AI. It's got, like, Mr. Beast, XQC... Andrew Tate, Donald Trump, SpongeBob, several others that may be worth your time and checking out. But for this video, we're back to clips. So on this uh, page, go to bot, clip command. Now you'll have to enable this here. And once you've uh, enabled it, you can set the parameters for who you want to make the clips. You can have this as a chat command. It's basically what it is. It's going to be a chat command, but we're gonna connect it to our stream deck. That way we can push one button to trigger that chat command. But also, there are other people who can clip. So to create the clip, it's going to be exclamation point clip by default. And then you would set the time, which is 30 by default. So all this is enabled. Let's just make it to where everyone can do it. We're done here. Now we'll go over to our stream deck. We'll hit the store page. We'll type in kickbot. And only 2.1k downloads. So I'm saying, I'm thinking not a lot of people know about this. Very easy function. And so we're going to install that. Already done it on our side. So we're here. We're going to type in KickBot here and find it. Create clip. And you'll just drag that over, obviously, into your uh, Stream Deck. Now, once we're here, we set the clip length here. Now, I have mine at 30 by default. Now, your KickBot key. This is the most important part of this video. If this is not in there and you do not hit save, it will not work. Just as simple as that. Where do you find the KickBot key? I'm glad you asked. Back over to the website on KickBot. Uh, you'll click the settings tab, and here is your Stream Deck API key. Do not share. If you feel like it's been compromised, you can regenerate one. Copy paste it. Back to your Stream Deck. Now, uh, once you uh, copy paste that in, make sure hit the save button. Okay? So that button is now built in for when you're live, something happens, and you want to and you want to clip it, obviously. Uh, and we'll just go over to my chat real quick. We're not live, but if you would, drop us a follow. Kick.tv slash TreyLo20. Would love to meet you. But anyway, so we're going to hit the clip button. It's going to throw uh, the chat command right there. Clip 30. So that's going to say uh, TreyLo just generated a clip, and it's going to spit you out a URL for your clip. Note, these clips do not save to your Kick account. You cannot go at the end of your stream to these clips. They're not saved here. They are saved over in Click uh, Kickbot. How do you get to your clips? I'm glad you asked. Go back to your clip command. Sorry, and right here, a little link. They need to make this a little nicer, but uh, they'll get to it. Uh, if you'll go back to uh, clip command, this little link right here. Boom. View your clips here. You can click that button, and boom. There's all the clips that you've clipped while live. I hope this was helpful to you. Feel free to drop a like on the video. If you have questions, just drop a co comment down below. I get to the questions pretty quickly. Uh, if you have some more questions about how to set this up, super simple to do. Hope it was helpful for you. We'll catch you on the next one. We out.